First up, we kick off with an exclusive viewing of a billionaire's dream beach house. Located in Laguna Beach, this modern home has everything money can buy, including the most expansive ocean views. Welcome to 58 North Lucinda. Come on in. Today we're in Three Arch Bay, and we're right here on a dis distinctively unique bluff top. Actually, I would say the most unique bluff top in all of Three Arch Bay, and quite possibly all of California. This property is five bedrooms and seven baths. All the bedrooms are en suite with full bathrooms. It's got a gym. It's got a wine lounge that's connected to a theater with a porthole window into the show car garage where you can see the turntable and the Ferrari spinning. It's really extraordinary. One of the coolest features in this house for sure. Um, in addition to that, when you walk in the front door, you've got one bedroom up on the right wing of the home. But when you come downstairs, you also have two bedrooms off to the right wing, and then you have the master on to the left. And the master is perfectly situated out on the perch, looking directly up the coast from the master bedroom. So as you can see, there's already so much going on in this house prior to entering the front door. Well, from the walk-in gate, you'll come down a few steps over the guest house, and you'll see a long stretch of decking, and it looks just like a high fashion runway, and that runs alongside a 50-foot pool. And underneath that deck is a swim through from the kiddie pool connected to the jacuzzi. It's absolutely pristine. We've already passed the outdoor entertaining area and jacuzzi and pool and guest house, the barbecue and bar, and this incredible loggia with your outdoor television, beautiful fireplace, and into the formal dining room, which has Fleetwood doors that pocket and hide. Beautiful bar. And this Zen water feature leading to the front door of the house is incredible at sunset because it reflects the natural light. There's still so much more to see, guys. Come on inside. One of the most dramatic aspects of this home is the entry from the very beginning. But once you approach the front door, you're looking through glass and through glass and through glass, directly to the ocean. Massive unobstructed views from the very, very beginning of walking onto the property and through the front door. So here we are, we've entered the house in this incredible foyer that delivers directly down and down to your private beach pool. There are so few saltwater pools that were built in the early 1900s here in Orange County. I think it's uh, five or six pools. And this one in particular, this cove below, is uh, in my opinion and most opinion, the number one, the absolute best. And even has a wall that was man-made that has a cork in it and that cork actually can be removed. And when removed, the sand and the water and the tides and the level of surf will adjust the, the amount of sand in there. And at one point, you can empty it out and you'll have stairs that were built that go nine feet deep into the pool. So what we have here is an ancient vine from Thailand. When you enter the home in the foyer, off to the left, anchoring the foyer is an ancient vine from Thailand. It's a work of art in and of itself or like sculpture. And then above you, you have so much natural light flooding through the skylights that light boxes, designer light boxes have been placed in there that are one of a kind and allow the night light in the evening to shine through. And it's really an art feature in the home. Incredible natural light coming through the skylights and through these designer one of a kind light boxes that allow the night light to actually create its own ambiance. And off to the left, We've got the primary kitchen with a butler's pantry and kitchen around the corner and this amazing view deck off of this upper balcony. The goal here was to create a timeless masterpiece. That's exactly what they've done. So uh, where you have a contemporary and modern, somewhat minimalist design, the complexities and nuance that went into creating that feeling of serenity that it now has uh, was a very intricate and hard fought process. And behind you, we have an incredible family room. Family room with this gorgeous fireplace, Jackson Pollock artwork covering the TV. Again, its own deck and this fantastic lounge. But one of the primary things that you're gonna feel the second you walk in the door are these walls of glass and these incredible unobstructed pristine views of the ocean all the way up the coastline. This house has been perfectly married to the land that it sits upon. So this bluff top is as gorgeous as it gets. The beach pool is as gorgeous as it gets. Having the stairs down is really as rare as it gets. 
But at the end of the day, when you can actually take an interior finish and an exterior design and marry it to the elements, to nature, the sky, the ocean, and the sand, you've really achieved something, and that's what this is. And now, we go down my favorite staircase. Now this staircase is incredible as it's one piece of steel and was extremely difficult to even get in the home. Properties like these are true labors of love and they take a real sacrifice and uh, extreme level of commitment and of course expense. This home took four years just in the permitting process and took another four years to build. But on top of that, if you understand Laguna Beach bluff top or oceanfront construction for new builds, it's one of the most difficult cities to be able to accomplish this in particular. For example, when they came to this property and purchased it, there was an older structure on the property. And in order to keep some of the highly valuable uh, grandfathered aspects of the home intact for the new design, they had to hoist up half of the old structure, hold it in the air while they built around it. And that's what's allowed a lot of this to be the way it is, so close to the edge of the bluff top with these stairs that are in pristine condition that take you directly down to your own private saltwater pool. We arrive in the gallery, which leads to our gym. This home calms you and creates its own serenity. There's really nothing you can do about it. It's so balancing and harmonizing the effect of being on the property, but it's also invigorating and inspiring. So in down the hall here on the right lower wing, we have two other full guest rooms and also the secondary garage. But now I wanna show you some serious views from the master. Come on. So this master bedroom is truly masterful. Some of the exquisite features of this master bedroom are its orientation to the view, access to the patios and the stairs to that sandy beach pool, but also this warm fireplace, the Monterey cypress tree directly outside on the cliff, and then delivering you back to an incredible bathroom where you can lay in your tub and look directly out to the Pacific and Catalina at sunset. Even limestone floors that are raised, there's not one circular drain in this house. All of the rooms were meant to maximize the view of the ocean and the coastline. So they each have their own private decks. They all deliver directly to the staircase that takes you down to your own private sandy beach below. And even walks by unique features like uh, a tee box, where if you're a golf enthusiast, you can hit biodegradable golf balls into the ocean or chip them down to your own private flag on the sandy beach below, which I think is incredible. And if you like wine, sports cars, and your own theater, come with me. So welcome to the Poker Lounge, surrounded by fine wine and connected to your own personal home theater, looking directly into an insane performance garage. This home can hold 10 cars, four in the main sports car garage, and then two in the other full-size two-car garage, and then in the motor court, another four cars. Off of the street, you see that you've got a very, very sexy, curvilinear driveway, and one of the most uh, difficult things to achieve was for the builder to create what's called a running bond with those pavers that followed the exact contour of that windy driveway. And not only that, but deliver perfectly those pavers into each garage literally without one millimeter being off. And that took three attempts in order to get that. In addition, they actually built a wooden Ferrari, believe it or not, this is a true story, that was used to figure out the slope so any of the finest sports cars of the homeowner, of course, and his friends or guests would never have a problem bottoming out and they could feel comfortable delivering it down. So here we are in the show garage with its subterranean mechanics pit and then this turntable for your show car and room up to four cars. But as you can see, this homeowner is not only a high-tech innovator, but he's also an avid racer. The design of even the garage, the sports car garage is phenomenal. So even the garage door is something that you never see. But when you open that door, it reveals a subterranean mechanics pit next to a sports car show turntable and with walls lined of classic, vintage, rare motorcycles. A few very discerning people have walked into this home who could have anything in the world and instantly were taken by this it factor, 
We all talk about that. We know what that is when we feel it. It's not just something that you see, it's something that you sense. And this home literally has ohm. It, like I said, it's married to the land so beautifully. And then it's the epitome of architecture and design. It's been an incredible honor to take you on this tour today. Till next time.